Ladies and gents, welcome to the Gaming Apocalypse. I'm Wraith, and this is a new to me game, looks kind of interesting, called Ghost of a Tale. I have no idea what it's about, something to do with a mouse. Seems interesting though, but before we hop into it, just a quick reminder, you are an awesome person, so keep being awesome to others, okay? All right, let's jump in and find out what this game is all about, shall we? In the beginning was the green flame, a force without conscience, consuming all in its path. The creatures of the world fought back, but one by one they fell, only to rise again as puppets of the emerald fire. It was the rats alone who stood and fought, until at last at Paraclave the green flame was extinguished. Okay. Mara. Mara, where are you? Okay. So I guess this is our playable character. He's actually very cute. A red rose. New quest, Flowers from Mera. Stood before the Baron, your wife Mera at your side. He bid you play the poisoned cup, and you knew then this was not for his amusement, but a test. And so play you did. But from Mera there was only silence and a look of such defiance. He moved to strike her, the Baron, and you cried out and went to her. And then darkness. How many days have passed since then? In your heart you know she's still alive. That one day that you'll one day find her. Until then, all you have are these flowers, your memories of her, and a question, why? Interesting. So... We... Ooh. Great, cemented into the stone floor, cannot be messed with, okay. Oh, there's some bread. Press tab to access your inventory and eat. Okay, here you can also find information about quests and more. Okay, that's good. Uh, I found candlestick. Ah, food. Okay, a sour apple. Stale hunk of bread. So if I eat both of those, yes. Excellent. A uh, humble minstrel's hood and a belt made out of rope. Okay. Book of characters and their costumes, song book written and compiled over years on the road, book of pressed flowers, flowers that evokes for you memories of Mera. Your trusty loot, a figurine of your infant son Bryn, and a red rose. Okay. Oh, we get skills we unlock eventually. Quests. Collect roses, one of seventeen. Collect 17 roses in honor of Mera. Okay. Well, I mean, I see another one. There we go. So this said there's a mysterious message over here. Meet me at the top of the watchtower. Cover your tracks and move unseen. S. Oh. And they were nice enough to smuggle us the cell key, too. That's good of them. Those apples in there? It appears like they are. I don't know how I would actually get into that thing to get to them, though. Which is unfortunate. Got an apple core. Empty basin, empty chamber pot. I'm probably glad that those are empty. Hmm. Okay, interesting. 
interesting. So I hear something moving around. Making a whole lot of noise. And it doesn't sound like something I really want to mess with. Cell Manifest. Name, Tilo. Profession, Minstrel. Offenses, Acts of Sedition. What? Ooh, okay. Sackcloth hood, a couple of candles. Those might be useful. Florins and a fire steel. Oh, okay. You have attracted a guard's attention. Quickly go to the chest. Hold both mouse buttons to hide. Don't forget you can hide in many different places. noises too. Mm, seems like I went the wrong way. Pirate frog. Ferret's balls. What do you think you're doing, Mousy? Bringing, barging into my cell uninvited. Do you know who I am? Because I have no idea. Okay, well that, that's fair. Carold Red Whiskers. That's it. At least I was. Navigator of the Lake Witch under Captain Otto Powder Keg. No, I'm not here to rob you. The smell of mice and the smell of lies. Um, I could use your help. Being free is what got me in here in the first place. Well, that and the piracy thing. I think the piracy thing probably did more to get you put in here, but, you know... Damp air, all the flies I can eat, and my own stool. There is something down the corridor, the sleeping guard. I need you to strangle him. What? Because he called you a pirate. Aren't you a pirate? Like being a pirate's a crime. It, isn't that a crime? And I'm not ashamed of it. I mean, I can try. Oh, okay. Steal a bottle of his rot gut. I'll see if I can help. Okay. Exactly, would he keep his so called rot gut? Ooh, nothing inside of there. Some random bugs. Ah, I need a key. Sneaky, sneaky. Take the apple and the mushrooms. Hmm. What can I 
I take from over here? Empty wine bottle, hefty enough to knock out any guard without a helmet if they're enough precision. Used to create a distraction, dislodge an item from its perch, press E to throw. Mouse wheel up and down to cycle through tools. Okay. Whoop, whoop, whoop. So I got the bottle of vodka. And I got some keys too. Anything good in here? Another candle. Some more mushrooms. There's a door that goes down for some reason. Oh, I needed the flooded cell key for that. Okay. Ah, okay. So I guess I need to jump into here. Not very smart. Howdy there, bud. Uh, maybe? Every time that scrunt gets sells, I have to put up with his damn snore. <laughs> so you're trying to make it so that you don't have to listen to him snore anymore. A few of your questions, what is it you want? Uh, that's your first question, okay. What dungeon is this? Dwindling Heights Keep on the shore of Lake Vivalia. Let's get used to it. Right then. I'll give you two more questions. How long have I been here? It's been at least 10 days. Oh, wow. What? So you haven't seen her then? Alright, well, you're kind of useless. But at the same time, you're also enjoying yourself in jail, so. Okay, I did pick up a key off of that guy. So hang on, which key did I grab? I grabbed the screaming door key. Sewer key. Where exactly would that key be at? Oh, a stick. 
Okay. I can get an apple. It's worth something. It's also some extra mushrooms. It's always useful. Alright, our rat friend is asleep. Is locked. There is a pathway that went down. Jail Master Key for that one. Okay. I said, yeah. Some more mushrooms. Jeez, I'm going to have mushrooms coming out of my ears. Alright, so this door is locked as well. There's a whole lot of random bugs around here. Sneak, but only a short distance at a time. Somehow I feel like something called the screaming door is going to make a lot of noise when I open it up. That's not working the way I wanted it to. Okay. Uh. I wish she's going to knock that guy out, but apparently that was not an option. Or I guess I've knocked him out once, so you can't knock him out again. So good bit of game mechanics to learn about. Ooh, 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 ooh. Let's get in here. So what is your patrol route like? Do you just go back and forth or do you actually stop over there? Okay, so you go back and forth. Got it. Get back in, get back in. Yeah, 
go over there and stand guard for a little bit. the door, which I'm going to have to assume he can see through the door, but shouldn't be too big of a deal. Okay, that was my my own fault there. I should have. I was hoping I could use that to like throw it at somebody, but apparently not. Yeah, I kind of deserved that. Right. I don't see anything. Oh, great. Fate card, huh? Oh, great. I mean, it's kind of a terrible hiding spot, if I'm being honest with you. But I guess it works. keys I have to find. Which key does this one have, I wonder? Assuming he even has a key. We're going to try something a little bit dangerous. We're going to let this guy go back around the corner. And then I want to try smacking him in the head with a bottle. Knock him unconscious, see if I can pickpocket him a little bit.
Is there really nothing I can take off of him? Well, that sucks. Jail Master Key. Also locked. Uh, well, he's already back up too. That's bad. Maybe if I throw the bottle at the door, he'll open the door for me? else. didn't even break. Hmm. Nope, 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 nope. Alright. Clearly I am missing something. Not sure what. Oh god, I'm clipping through the game. My bad. Something else I'm not seeing. You need the cupboard key. Well, I mean, there's a stick. That could be useful. I think they want to go to sleep. I'm not sure where this other thing I'm supposed to find is at. Jump in 
one's out of here. I'm guessing I'm supposed to be doing something with the banners, maybe? Come on, go back the other way. Okay, so I can set the banners on fire. I don't know what that really does for me, though. What did that do? Other than burn the thing. I mean, it definitely got his attention. So I can set that one on fire. That's good to know. Hmm, oh, okay. Oh. Can't do anything with that. Found a bucket that I can stand on, but I have nowhere to stand on it at. Interesting. Hmm. Another banner here, but I'm not sure what I would do with this. Well, actually. I won't. Screw it. Might as well go ahead and burn the banners while I'm in here. I don't think he's going to do anything. Yeah. They have a pretty fast reset timer. It's definitely an interesting little game. Uh, I'm very curious as to what it's supposed to be about. Well, I understand what it's about, but I'm curious as to what I'm supposed to be doing right now in it. Uh, I don't seem to be able to do a whole lot insofar as finding the keys that I need. So I've, I've already knocked both of the guards out and got the only key that either one of them had so hmm. it's an interesting one we'll uh we'll have to keep poking at it until i can figure it out 
I am sorry the video ran a little bit long. Hopefully I can avoid that in the future. But anyways, if you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. I'll keep the YouTube overlords happy. And if you want to see what's going to happen next time, well, you need to subscribe and ring the notification bell. That way you know when new videos get released. So anyways, until next time, thanks very much for watching. Hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. And remember the life does get rough sometimes. So good luck, have fun, stay awesome. I'll catch you in the next one.